Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I make this barrette and this necklace out of basically junks. Super easy and I feel like everyone can do it themselves, so without further ado, let's get right in. So I think most of you guys know, already know this brand, Marine Seer. Basically, they do a lot of upcycling stuff and I happen to own one of their necklaces. Kind of has the same idea as this one. So for this barrette, I actually wanted to get um, a marine sear one, but you know, it was always out of stock, and I thought, hmm, actually I can make it my own. For materials, I went to this thrift shop in Brooklyn called the Mother of Junks, and I found all these weird stuff, um, keys and pendants in this pile. Materials you would need a barrette, some pliers, a sewing kit, C rings, some safety pins, a necklace chain, and some random items like the keys. So the first step is to place the items onto the barrette in the arrangements that you want. And then grab some safety pins to pin down your objects to the barrette so that it won't move. After you've done that, make sure the items don't fall and you can decide if you want to add some more on the other side. And then go ahead and put it on and try it out on your head to see the actual look. Next step is to take the C-rings and open them up, attach them with your little objects, and then sew it onto your barrette. It's all the same technique with every single item that you put it on. I decided to only have one side with the keys and pendants hanging down because I like it better this way. And don't forget to try it on multiple times to see how it looks. Next, for the necklace, it's all the same technique because you already have the chain, so you just have to use the C-rings to connect your pendants and the necklace. So as you guys saw, it was super super easy to make. Actually, it doesn't require any type of serious skills. This would be a very unique piece um, if, you, if you decided to make one. So Marine Sierra is not the only brand or person that does this type of designs. There's this punk icon named Judy Blame back in the 80s who was also an accessories designer. He was very well known for his accessories being full of these buttons or keys and little random stuff. So a few years ago, the Italian brand Moschino actually had a collab with Judy Blame and the barrettes and the accessories were just awesome. And unfortunately, the icon himself passed away in 2018. And afterwards, Dior Men, led by Kim Jones, actually had a tribute collection to Judy Blaine. So again, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on our Instagrams. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.